guys so the vjump scan images are finally in and in this video we will be dissecting pretty much frieza's movesets abilities and stats so this video is actually going to be a real good one guys and if you guys do find this video helpful anytime throughout dropping a like would be greatly appreciated and as well as if you guys are not subscribed please do consider subscribing because i cover here everything dragon ball legends so guys let's just not waste any time whatsoever here we go guys so on the left image i combined two images by no means these are high definition but what matters is that we can actually figure out his movesets and uh, abilities and as well as his stats so that's what's important here and his artwork is really cool too so um shout out to db legends japan aka miguel via twitter and uh yeah like i said let's just not waste any time here here on the left image we see frieza holding the uh, seven dragon balls and in the back we see paragus we see frieza and we see uh broly before of course he goes berserk and then in the bottom left we see his stats which we will go over i did include a uh, stat chart here where my camera is supposed to be but i thought this would be more helpful in this video for you guys uh, to see these stat charts instead of my face <laughs> so uh also guys here on the right image it's him using his uh, death beam, which what I first thought was Paragus, uh, but it looks actually like the Broly Fury uh, before it goes Berserk and all that good stuff. So, uh, And he does indeed also have an ultimate. We will go over all the movesets and abilities in this video as well as the stats. So as for his stats, like I said, there's a little translation box here on the bottom left of my screen and then as well as the bottom left of the image. So here we go, guys. Uh, he is a ranged type unit if we look at the last little uh nick right there on the corner on the bottom right corner uh, we see that his key blast is all the way through the roof so he's gonna be doing a lot of blast damage now i don't know if uh loe really needed a a blast unit to be honest with you guys but this frieza does more than just than just be like he, he does more than just blast honestly because when I read his uh, abilities and stats, he's actually a very, very interesting unit, which we'll go over in just a little bit. So uh, what he really lacks is key region. I mean, look at his key region, guys. Take a look at that. His key region is pretty much non-existent. So, um, But if you were to ask me, uh, out of all these stats, out of all these five stats, which one would you actually like the least or which one would you rather you know, not support as much? I would probably say key region because his HP is pretty solid. His strike attack is actually pretty solid for a range type unit. And his uh, defense is actually also pretty solid. So, uh, yeah, I mean, defensive stats are there, you know, pretty much. And his key blast. The only thing that's really, really missing with this unit is his key region. But I always say that what's really important with the character is his kit. So let's just quickly break down his kit, guys. So this is, uh, I mean, it's crazy how we can pretty much decipher uh, real quick. Uh, what he has so uh here we go guys it says so let's see frieza's performance and by the way this might sound a little bit iffy just because this is a translation from japan to english and the translations are never like 100 percent but we can actually figure out what what's going on here so uh a ranged attacker capable of capturing the enemy's dragon ball so he's he he's a mix of like a shenron shenron uh not only can he or demon king piccolo uh he, he actually could steal dragon balls and then shenron as well gets stronger while he has dragon balls in his possession so uh it goes on to say his damage increases depending on the number of dragon ball he possesses his special move is death beam that killed paragus um and for as for paragus guys um if he comes out in this banner i i envision him being an ex unit so um if there's any time a paragus would come out now would be the time so i kind of do envision a paragus coming out as an ex unit or support unit or with a good z ability as well so i'm actually kind of looking forward to that i actually kind of like paragus uh it goes on to say the move that caused broly to become super sane so yeah like like uh <laughs> like in the movie scene where he tragically the the, the, the beam tragically uh ricocheted and uh take out uh paragus so that kind of sucks but yeah uh he, he had surprisingly this guy has an ultimate so usually when um uh, when a character has an ultimate, they usually tend to put more effort into the character. So uh, the, the ultimate is Nova Storm, the one you guys see in the bottom right image. Uh, not too much to go off of there, I know, but uh, this is what we have so far, guys. Um, also, hitting with strikes or shooting stars will increase damage dealt by enemies. Now, like I said before, the translations are never 100%, but we could kind of get an idea of what's going on here. So it says hitting with strike cards, or I'm assuming it's, it says blast cards will increase the damage dealt by enemies so dealt by enemies hmm i don't understand what they mean by enemies 
maybe two enemies hitting with strike okay i'm not quite sure what that means um drop down the comment section below if you guys kind of like i don't know if you guys kind of just get the gist of this because like i said the, the translations are never 100 but it goes on to say unleash the final blow with the super powerful ultimate move so this character here um eloe really needed <laughs> eloe really needed a unit um i prefer for them to eventually either zenkai the green first year anniversary frieza or as well as the full power yellow frieza so those two units eventually i believe will get zenkai like any other unit would but i feel like those units if any loe units would um get zenkai those two would be the first ones to to get zenkai either that or the first first original uh yellow uh first form uh, final form frieza so uh this unit is actually looking pretty interesting although he does lack a lot of key regen uh he's a range type unit so uh, his stats are very well balanced besides um, anything else. Like his his key blast is through the roof, as you guys see through the stats. All right, let me uh, let me close this real quick. So his key blast um, is actually really good. Uh, his strike is fairly solid for a range type unit. His HP is very solid as well. His strike defense or uh, his defense in general stats are there as well. The only thing he really likes is key region now. Uh, what I always say in my videos, and if you guys are subscribed to me, you guys know how I feel about this. What I really care about a unit is his kit, right? And if we take a very quick look at his kit once more, uh, it really travels, like, it, it really, res like, it, it's all about the Dragon Ball. So that's why I said it was kind of a mix of a Demon King Piccolo and Shenron. So, um, it all, his first ability is really interesting because it says, um, it's, okay, so it says a ranged attacker with capable of capturing the enemy's Dragon Balls now. I don't know if that's going to be a main ability, kind of like Demi King Piccolo, or a maybe Super Saiyan 2 transforming um, Team Gohan from the Bojack movie, where he switches in, and then uh, your enemy loses a Dragon Ball, but he doesn't collect one, that Gohan, but maybe this uh, Freezer will collect one. So, uh, it could go either way, I don't know, maybe maybe it says right here, a ranged attacker capable of capturing enemies' Dragon Balls, maybe every time he hits, uh, he hits you with a blast attack, maybe there's like, I don't know, like a 10% chance, 5% chance, of, of him being able to steal a Dragon Ball. And then uh, maybe he gets a a 15 to 20% buff or 10% buff. I don't know how much does Shenron get. I'm not quite sure. But maybe a 10 to 15% buff for each Dragon Ball he possesses. So, uh, yeah. I mean, this character is looking pretty interesting. Because, like I said, I really always care about the kit in itself. Uh, just as opposed to, like, raw stats. Raw stats is, I think, a little bit overrated. Unless you're Gohan. But Gohan, uh, that the LF team Gohan actually has... Uh, a good kit as well besides just berserk stats so yeah guys that's pretty much going to cover the video as for the other unit that didn't get revealed uh because usually there's at least two units in v jumps that gets revealed i believe it's either going to be gogeta of course super saiyan blue gogeta or a broly so don't count out a broly super saiyan blue gogeta guys is not 100 percent confirmed uh it could indeed be a broly but i do see at least one of the two or both coming out at the same time or a Gogeta and as well as a Zenkai Broly. So it could go either way, guys. But yeah, if you enjoyed the video, make sure you guys give it a thumbs up and subscribe if you haven't already. Because here, I pretty much just cover Dragon Ball Legends daily on my YouTube. So yeah, guys, I'll definitely catch you guys tomorrow. Have a good one. Peace.